Right, so my first run of Cinebench on my new Coffee Lake system here uh, left is by my uh, sec uh, first generation Core i7, right is my um, eighth generation Core i5 and 8400, and it should be a lot faster, so uh, I'm curious. Um, we have our hands at the, the run buttons for the CPU test of Cinebench, so let's see what it does. Three, two, one, click. So I wonder if it's a lot faster or a bit faster, I have no idea. It seems to be different. But just want to wait with the uh, task manager. Well, I think the Cry 5 is winning. Coffee Lake is winning. Can you imagine that the left one has 8 cores and the right one only has 6 cores? So it's uh, it's beautiful, if you ask me. That's the power of Coffee Lake Core i5. I'm convinced. So you see the difference. It's uh, I think a 20-30% gain in uh, performance here. It's still not done. In the meantime I can get up the task manager and show you um, that it actually has six cores and six threads, so no hyper-threading here. And the uh, i7, the third generation i7, uh, it's not the most expensive one, but it's still, it's a good CPU, you know. Uh, it has four cores and eight threads, so it's hi it has hyper-threading, and it's a core i7, but you can see it's a big difference stepping up from a third generation uh, system to an eight eighth generation system, so I can only advise to do that. Thank you, Intel.